we would like to bring on the highlights of tonight's events. Just to give you a little background information about them, this is an uh, internationally acclaimed jazz artist, vocalist, and composer, Rick De La Rata. I think a lot of you know about him and have heard about him. He's considered by many to be one of the finest singer, pianists performing today. He's one of the only and a handful of jazz artists who can make a successful music presentation to a large audience without abandoning the true art of jazz. Through his life, long endeavor to help people reach their highest potential through the understanding of jazz, as well as spreading peace worldwide through his Jazz for Peace World Tour, Rick is considered an innovator and visionary. Tonight's performance, ladies and gentlemen, I'm sure is something a lot of you uh, have been waiting for. I think I, I, maybe some of you attended the performance last night, but today is going to be truly exceptional. Just to give you a little bit more information about them, in 2007, his, the jazz pianist, vocalist and composer, as I mentioned, Rick De La Rata, was included by the Foundation Center in their list of musician philanthropists with Bono, of U2, Elton John, Peter Gabriel, and Sting. The UN concert has led to be a benefit concert series that has gone on to raise funds, publicity, and awareness for over 500 nonprofit organizations, garnered support and praise from distinguished Americans such as Barack Obama, Senator John McCain, Secretary of State Hillary Clinton, and Congressman Dennis Kucic. Now, ladies and gentlemen, please, I'd ask you all to give the warmest welcome to Rick De La Rata and his Jazz for Peace Band. Let's give him a big round of applause. Thank you.